We're going to tour a truck camper pop-up, which is pretty awesome. Okay, so check it out. I am here with Linda, and she's going to take us on a tour. How you doing, Linda? Hi there. Great. Beautiful day. So tell me about this awesome camper. This is our uh, 2020 Palomino pop-up truck camper. Automatic lifts. You can lift it up, pull this truck out, and then go with this truck and this stays here where we can camp. Uh, you open the door, there's a remote that they automatically raise and lower with the button. Um, you want to see inside? Sure. Okay, this is our truck camper. This is a queen size bed. It has storage on both sides. Table and benches for our meals. We have a stove over here, two burner, propane stove. Kitchen sink. All this over. You have your sink and then you have a place to work. Microwave, refrigerator. This is storage, and they have different places to put it. I keep my towels in there. But this is our first time camping with it. To your left, you'll find a shower and a bathroom. Let me open the door for you. So it's the all in one. It has the air, it has heat. You want to roll up the uh, shades and it's curtains that you slide it, you unzip the window, and then you have the air coming in. And it's all the way around. And then there's... Is this open or is this just for sunlight? That's sunlight. Okay. And then up here are the sunrooms and it's a okay. fan. This is your maiden voyage. Yes, so good. how is it going? It's good. Um, we're learning a lot of new stuff. And you can see it's a little tight. So we do a lot of outside. I haven't cooked in here yet. By watching YouTube, I, you don't want cooking smells in here because they linger. So I've cooked outside so far. And do you guys eat here or you would eat outside? We eat outside, but if it should be a rainy day, we have a place to sit in here and talk, play cards, whatever. This is a window. Here's the storage here, my vacuum cleaner. Storage here. And there's storage on both sides. Here's the table down. And it, if you don't need it, we just store it. It stores underneath the, the mattress. And the pole comes out and it stores underneath this uh, little step here. But um, it leaves you a lot of more room without the table. Very nice. There's solar on top. Do water and electric for the first year. Then we get used to it. And then it's for a shower. When did you get this? A couple months ago. Ladder so we can reach and hook up the. When that comes down, it latches. I use it to do dishes. Okay. Better than doing it in there. So you have a nice greenhouse. So the cooking you do out here. I do. Yeah. I went out and bought a. Also, and all kinds of pans, and this is a cute little thing over here I like. Excuse me, it's from breakfast. A little one just for two people, yeah. or one if you want. It's a nice greenhouse too. Does it go up easy? Yeah, it's called an easy up. I try to keep the sand up. Like I said, I put this down, and then I want to put the outdoor mat down. Bill, you're not a man of many words, but I know you have a great truck here. So tell me again, why did you pick this specifically, or why did your husband pick this specifically? Okay, we picked the um, pop-up truck camper because we like to vacation in different ways. We have uh, we go off-roading with side-by-side -side quads, so we can trailer that with us. Or we go by boat and we take uh, boat vacation. So this way we're able to have our home and 
uh, whatever recreation we want to do. He has a kayak trailer too. So it all depends on what we're doing. So this allows you to, the ability to tow, you don't have to tow a trailer, but you can tow your quad in a trailer, you can tow a kayak on, on its trailer, yes. or you can tow your boat. Right. Where otherwise, if you had a travel trailer, I don't believe you could tow all that. No. You're only allowed to tow one, he said. So this is perfect for that then? Yeah, that's why we thought this would be perfect for us for now. And when's the next trip? Uh, two weeks. We're okay. going to the Poconos for an off-roading vacation. At the end of July, we're doing a um, boat vacation in Maryland. This is my practice. We lived not far. We wanted to do someplace close in case we had a problem. But the practice worked out good? It did. But you did find out about the, the refrigerator that you got to get that looked yes. at. So that was a good practice then. Even though it's brand new, we've, like I said, uh, we've only had it a few months, but um, the refrigerator wasn't getting cold. So we have to take it into the shop. Well, hopefully you'll have that back in time for your trip. I hope so. Alrighty. Thank you so much, Linda, and happy camping with this. Thank you. All right. Take care. Take care, Sharon. That's a wrap, everyone. You know what to do if you like this video. You all come back now, you hear?